set the fucking timer, that would help. Don't worry, you're not good, I'm three. How are we feeling? Hello everybody, welcome back to the weekly vlog, welcome back to the channel, thank you so much for watching, I hope you're all doing well. I say it's a weekly vlog, it is actually Wednesday evening, I've just entered a new training box, training for High Rocks, if you watched last week's vlog, that's what I announced, that we are now training for High Rocks doubles, and that is coming up at the end of July. I did film a little bit of Monday's workout session which was a lower body session. I didn't film a lot from it, but it was really, really good. And then yesterday, that was yesterday? Yesterday I had an amazing upper body session, which unfortunately I didn't film anything of. It's really hard, especially at my local gym to film anything, but just know, I'm being honest with you guys, that my training the last couple days has been amazing. I say that, but today my training didn't really happen. I mean, it did, I went to the gym, but I was intending to do a tempo run today. That didn't happen. I basically I just had like a bit of a sleep in this morning and then I had my eyebrow appointment. They're fresh, <laughs> planned at 12 o'clock. And by the time I sort of got up, I was like, oh, I could go and do a run now, but if I do that, I'll probably be cutting it short again and I wanna give myself full time. So I'll do a run in the afternoon. And of course it gets the afternoon and I just can't be bothered. All the motivation's gone down the toilet. So I often find that. I often find I really need to train in the morning because I just really struggle to train anywhere after lunchtime. So yeah, that's just me making excuses, but I am gonna insert some footage now of my training from Monday. <laughs> I know I've just said I'm really bad at filming, but I have all intentions of filming a lot of what is going on over the weekend. That is because on Saturday, I am having a high rocks training session. God help me after my <laughs> shift on Saturday morning at the gym, but I'm planning to hopefully train with my high rocks partner and potentially another girl that I work with who's also doing high rocks after work on Saturday. And I am gonna try and film a lot of that because I think that'll be a really, really fun, crazy session. High rocks training has honestly, in the week that I've been doing it, been very humbling. I feel very confident in some things and very not confident in others. And I think the confidence overall to complete it is currently lacking, but we're gonna get there and it's really fun. I am enjoying having a bit of variety and a bit of like endurance training part of my routine now because it's not something I typically do. Like I haven't really done a lot of like ski erg in the past or and I've never really used a sled before. So it's just fun incorporating a lot of movements that I haven't typically done before and I find it's making me a bit more excited and amped for training. So that is the one thing you can definitely look forward to this week. I will film it, I will film it. And then of course, as I mentioned, I've started a run club on Sunday and I'm super, super excited. So we are doing a 5K run this week with some on and off every 500 meters of just walking breaks in between because it's casual cardio. You know, it's not that serious. We're here to have fun. We're here to just get out, get a run in and have a chat and have some coffee. So that is the plan for the week. In between that, so as I said, it's Wednesday now, Thursday, Friday, I, Friday, I'm going to try and do a run. I shouldn't say try. I am going to do a run on Friday morning, but tomorrow with work, if you guys know by now, I work Thursday morning. So it's just, I just sack off training on a Thursday. Thursday is ultimately a rest day. And then Friday morning we'll do a run, but yeah, probably not too much happening. I probably won't even film that much the next two days because again, I'm just going to be at work. So I will make the majority of this vlog really entertaining and very exciting and all fitness based. So <laughs> stay tuned. And I'll catch up with you guys a little bit later. Hello, everyone. Happy Saturday. I'm here with my podcast co-host, who I Hi. haven't seen on YouTube yet, and my High Rocks double partner. And we and, are- And friend. And friend. <laughs> some girl, I know. <laughs> we are set up and we're ready to do some High Rocks training and we're going to try and film some of it. So the plan of attack is basically to do a run through of the course without any of the actual running parts. They're just yes. all the stations. So it gives a good opportunity to see where our strength and weaknesses are figure out who should be picking up more of the slack in certain exercises and so on and so forth. So, we've set up the room a little bit. It's currently not too busy in the gym, which is ideal, but it may get busier, so we'll see. We're gonna get started. First up, ski egg. Warm up. Warm up. Should we do a warm up? We should probably do a warm up, okay.
begin. It's getting my watch started. Oh, I need to set the fucking timer, that would help. All right, so 200 meters, let's go. That's it, keep going, keep going, keep going. That's it, you got it. That's it, push, 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 push. That's it, keep going, keep going, keep going, keep going, keep going. How long is this? Oh, we're guessing around 10, right? 10, so we'll have to... <laughs> so you just have to get to the end. Ah! <laughs> Why are you getting caught? should be practicing her burpees in the background for me. I can't do them very well. No, so <laughs> Ella's gonna be in charge of the burpees. Like we already kind of knew this was the problem, but it's just solidified today because she's actually quite good. Thanks. <laughs> Whereas I'm not so much. Look at her go. Mate, unstoppable. <laughs> 80 meters oh. later. All right, I'm saying we're done for the burpee section. On to what's next? Uh -huh. Is it lunges? Fuck me. I hope it's farmers carry. So farmers, please be farmers, please be farmers. Give me a sec. Rowing. Rowing, okay. Okay. Okay, so select workout, you work out. I'm gonna do a thousand meters again. Yeah. All right, do you want the dam or a 10? We can start it at five, that's fine. We can only change it once in the actual thing. So once it's changed, it's, it. it's gotta stay. Oh. Actually, yeah, yeah. Do you want to do a happy medium where we take it Seven. up to like eight? Yeah, let's start at eight and then okay. we can bring it down to five. It automatically starts at five, so if we change it, we change it. Oh, right, right. You're with me. I'm with You're you. with me. But we can't move it down to lower it to five. My camera's about to die. And I think we'll stop five times. Yeah. Speed walk. You'll probably carry the farms, carry. Nah, you got this. <laughs> it's a, it feels weird. It does. So we're onto the lunges. My camera is about to die. And again, I've done three and I'm battling. My left leg just does not want to stand back up again. 
Right leg's fine. Left leg, kaput. Is that low enough? Oh! Yeah, I still think you might have to go a bit lower. I might have to go fucking with that bitch. I think you're gonna have an issue with my foot too, so. Yeah, because you have to sweat my eyes. You have to get tapping going. So you really need, I think, to go somewhere like. Yeah. I can't get up from that. Again, I can feel the shape of your foot. Yeah. <laughs> and it's really hard because, like, I learned squats to my knee. Right? Then I have to relearn. Than that. Yeah. I From the gym I've just had a shower and I'm just getting ready with my partner and I'm gonna go out to dinner in a couple of hours and I'm just pretty much chilling on my bed watching the Kardashians and I'm about to start doing some makeup and get ready but yeah a humbling experience yet again <laughs> training for high rocks I mean I don't think we, I don't know if we filmed it I'll obviously review on the footage but I definitely struggled with the burpee broad jumps because basically the high rocks rules are super specific with each movement so there was a few things there's a few exercises that I'm a little bit concerned about. The first of all is the burpees, which I was always concerned about. <laughs> when you go down to do a burpee, I think a lot of people, when you go down, you typically do put your hands a little bit far forward. So when you go down, you're like, you know, like that. But the high rocks will say they're meant to be as close to your feet as possible, maximum like one foot away. So that that's gonna take some practice. I just, my hip flexor mobility seems to be an issue with that and a couple of other exercises. So I'm gonna work on that. Luckily, Ella is phenomenal at it. So at this stage, she's gonna be doing most of it. <laughs> and then second of all, the lunges. Again, I'm having a lot of hip, glute, upper quad pain on my left side, which is a result of the runner's knee. And I really struggled with the lunges today, putting the weight on this leg to get up, like the leg that's got that pain. The other leg's absolutely fine, can do it. Unfortunately, High Rocks Rule says you must alternate legs. So I think I just need to work on that. I'm getting treatment for it. So hopefully, hopefully that'll be okay in the long run. And lastly, the, the wall balls at the end. 
So basically you're squatting down, doing a wall ball up. Um, again, Ella will be predominantly doing that <laughs> because high rocks rules say that your hips have to be below your knees when you do the squat. I don't have the mobility for that as it stands. Like I had Ella look at me being like, this is probably as comfortable as I can go. And we were like, we think it's not, we're not, we don't think it's deep enough. <laughs> we'll see. Cause when I'm just doing my regular range of motion, which is still squatting down, like I'm still going low. I'm just not fucking going as slow as my hips passing my knees. I can do, I can do them fine. Like it's obviously challenging, but I can do them. So yeah, few things to work on, but overall like a good first team training session. It was the first session that Ella and I have trained together. And we basically just did a run through of the exercises with like appropriate, like approximate distances. Obviously I did not complete my portion of the distance for the lunges, burpees and wall balls. But we're thinking that at this stage, like worst case scenario, I will pick up the slack and like, ca not carry because Ella is obviously more than capable, but I can do a lot more of the, for example, farmer's carry and the sled pull because they are quite manageable sort of movements for me. And obviously we haven't even incorporated the fact yet that we are gonna be doing running in between. Um, Ella's a bit more nervous on the running because she's still, she's not, she doesn't run, she hates running. <laughs> Whereas for me, obviously I've got that base training so I'm okay with that. But yeah, the thought of putting everything together is still very, very scary. But anyway, it was really fun um, training with someone and seeing what we can and can't do basically. <laughs> so we just finished up our little date night and the cutest thing just happened we went to pay our bill and someone paid it for us apparently this these people what <laughs> he just tried to open the wrong side of the car for himself yeah these people settled our bill for us and there was just a note saying like pay it like paying it forward bless how nice is that? We just had a full fucking pizza, pasta, cocktails paid for for us. <laughs> what a good night. Very nice people. What a nice you. people. Oh. Good morning, guys. It is Sunday and it is Run Club Day. We're off to a great start. I left home, realized I didn't have my watch on, which would make it kind of hard to pace and know when we've done 500 meters and stop. Um, and as the person who is running Run Club and who set the pace and just know when to stop, kind of important. So I had to quickly turn around and go back home, grab my watch. But we've sorted now, we've got it on. Luckily I was running a little bit early this morning, so nothing too stressful. I've just put up the station. It is a little bit cold today, so I'm keeping my jumper well with me until it is time to run. And I'm really excited. I'm actually just excited as well obviously to talk to new people and like socialize and everything but like to run in such a nice environment like outside again and just like chill like oh it just makes it makes it so much more enjoyable i'm gonna go wait on the platform and head head to the sea for run club that with like a bit more enthusiasm. Yeah. Pretend you're not like dying and <laughs> it's not under duress. <laughs> Run club done and dusted. How are we feeling? Good. 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 Now time for coffee. Woo! <laughs> All right, guys, I've just got back to my car. Run club done and dusted for the week. And oh my God, it was so much fun. I hope the girls enjoyed it. It was really nice. A bigger group today. I say a big group, there's five of us, but bigger group today than what has been the last couple of weeks. So shout out to Narissa and Alyssa for coming along. It was so lovely to meet you girls and I hope everyone had a really good time. I had a great time. It's just like the weather at the moment is stunning. Like, cause we're out of the summer now. So it's hot, but it's like not unbearably hot and just being by the water and chatting it just makes it feel so much nicer like it just makes running so much more enjoyable so it was an absolute blast i am now have so many chores to do when i get home so i'm just gonna go and meet my partner at the shops do some shopping and then do a bunch of chores so i'll probably jump on a little bit later but there's not much going on today i'm not gonna lie to you now that was that was the highlight of my day stay tuned guys but 
that's probably it. Good morning, guys. It is Monday morning, and not so surprisingly, nothing exciting happened yesterday afternoon. Did some groceries, did some chores, had a nap, went to bed. That was it. So I just wanted to quickly sign off the vlog. I hope you enjoyed seeing some of the high rock training coming to Run Club. It was so much fun. I actually had a really great weekend. This is a reminder, if you haven't already, hit that subscribe button. Leave me a thumbs up. Remember we do all the things together here and I'll catch you in the next video. Bye guys.